Hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome back to Vagante. It's been a while. I say this all the time. Let's play Rogue. I feel, I feel lazy. Strong. Do I feel like being strong? Survivor? Let's just be a survivor. It's been a while. So, uh, part of the reason why I haven't been playing this game recently, the developers are, uh, developers are on vacation. So, kind of, so am I. Oh, fuck. I'm not used to these controls. It's been a long time since I've played this game, and it's actually messing with my head a little. Alright, let's just immediately put on some da- okay, good. It was not- it was not bad for me. But so... Developers have been on vacation. So, that means there aren't a whole lot of games. Um... There- like, there haven't been any updates for a while. Have I farmed for uh, risks and cash- cash or not? Not yet! I haven't had the chance to do so. Damn it. I have... I'm probably not going to be able to farm for anything in Cashronauts for about a week, week and a half, give or take. Okay, thank you for that. Okay, he's going to come up here. We need to think about life for a second. We've thought about life. We've combined it with the bomb arrow, put on a cursed helmet like a dingus. And we've, uh... Hmm. I'm not worried about this one. Okay, uh, did Vagante just update? Nope. Probably won't for a week or two. I don't know. I don't know how long the developer's update, uh, not update, vacation is going to end up being. I hope it's not too long, because they said the next major update, and this is the other reason why I haven't played this game in a while. They said the other, um, the other main thing they're kind of working on that they haven't, uh, that's been slowing them down so much, and that's why no n new major features or content has been added, is, uh, they're working on, uh, they're working on online multiplayer next. Damn it. Thought I was cheesing this guy particularly well. At least we got the, at least we've got the, the campfires to work with. Okay, am I going to be streaming all night? Well, not all night, but, uh, most of the night. Okay, we get a kerchief. Kerchief is mana shield. Nice. Okay. Ah, <sighs> but, um... Ah, shit, not this guy. Well, at least I have, like, nothing to steal. Dude's kind of a bitch, though. Okay, but, yeah, so they're working on online multiplayer. I think I mentioned this the last episode, technically. But I figured I'd, it's worth reiterating, just because it's such an important feature for me. Uh, but I was actually trying to kind of... Whoop, don't want to be there. Not if that's coming. There we go. Yeah, got him to kill himself. Let's just try not to do the same to ourselves. But uh, I was kind of trying to, trying to like wean myself off of the game just for a bit. Because I didn't want to... I didn't want to go into online multiplayer. Whoa, that's a small platform. Weird. Not used to that. I didn't want to go into online multiplayer, um, tired and stuff, you know? Oh. Because, I don't know, as much as I like this game, there's only so much content to it. And there's no, like, adventure, and there's really not a whole lot of variety of, like, choice. Like, I can get hours and hours and hours out of uh, Binding of Isaac. In fact, I think I've played Binding of Isaac so, uh, substantially more than I have played this game. Jeez, that did a lot of damage. Um, but that's because Binding of Isaac has, you know, very varied runs every single time. Whereas this one is just kind of a matter of, like, how lucky you were with equipment. Which is kind of a shame. But there's no, like, difference in real gameplay. Which is kind of a shame. Oh, uh, what's the story with this game? Uh, you were part of a cavern. Uh, ca cavern. Caravan. Caravan goes by monsters and stuff like that. And, um... And you decide to go uh, eliminate them for the safety of the nearby area. Let's see, if I remember the Punch Wizard? Yeah. Oh man, the Punch Wizard was fun. Okay. So let's see. I'm trying to keep up with chat as I'm going along here, seeing as it's kind of weird Q and A time. But fuck. Okay. Do not want to take falling damage yet. Oh, you know what? What if I just hang and jump? There we go. That's a little bit more efficient. Okay. But, 
I would I would totally dig nope nothing I would totally dig having um having a lot of friends to play this game with and I do and they've all agreed to uh, play the game with me bring back the fist of here I could right now I just feel like playing something basic because I haven't played the game in a while uh, but let's see get a little bit of healing let's throw on the gauntlets the heavy punches all right Second level in this, and let's switch to our fists. All right, we're almost full health. Nice. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Online multiplayer is going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. All right, so we're not going to be the fist of man, so we're just going to be the fist of roger. Actually, in retrospect, I should probably stealth up if I'm fist of roguing things. Because fist of roguing, I mean, 12 damage is pretty solid. Okay. Let's just, let's just scoot. Feeling good about life. Nope! Well, that was quite possibly, I didn't, I'm mean, not entirely sure how that even happened. Okay, so we've just gone from like bad to incredibly fucking, ah, 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 ooh. Okay, so we ruined just about everything there. I don't, oh, I was probably trying to stealth up on a platform and it decided that that was going to count as, um, that was going to count as me wanting to drop down through the platform. Oh, well. It's not the end of the world. Let's see. Feeling good so far. Let's see. Just punch him, punch him. Get out of here. See if we can stealth up before he reaches me. He still... Does he... Does he not know where I went? He should. Well, at least we got enough knockback... That he can still hit me with that sword. Okay, so we've taken a lot more damage here. Uh, not the end of the world. Uh, our armor is currently cursed. Can't do much about that. And we're feeling good. We do have one very small section of water. Are they both dam damage reflection? Pretty much, yeah. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Could be worse. Okay. So we're just going to just keep stealth punching him. Boop. Boop. No fire for you. Okay. Uh, Mubit, Mubot isn't Wanderbot, is he? No. Well, Mubot is mine. I set him up, but that's it. Okay. So let's just... Let's just keep scooting. Yeah, we got this guy down. Man, it's been a while since I've properly used stealth in this game. Usually I just run in guns blazing, which is dumb. It's totally dumb. Because this does way more damage. With way less personal risk. Okay, let's see what else we got around here. Oh, we've got a dude. And a bat? Where'd the bat come from? I'm not sure where the bat came from. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. Oh, no. You know what I need to start playing? Yeah. Okay. Apparently took damage from him. News to me. I need to start playing um, Shadowrun. Because uh, the next one's coming out in three weeks. Okay, there's nothing over there anyway, so we're not wasting our time. We're not going to have to waste our time trying to get past the boulder. Good. We've got projectile reflection in retrospect. Yee. I don't know how powerful this run's going to be, but it's definitely confidence-inspiring to a small degree. Okay. So let's throw this on. Please be something better. Eh, it's marginally so. Did I? Okay. Good. I did use the... The uh, treasure key on the last floor. I always hate missing it. Let's just murder this guy in the corner and scoot this all the way over here. Boop. Oh, that didn't kill him. Boop. That killed him. I'm glad they uh, retooled the chest so they still give you potions. Those were some dark days before uh, when they took them out for a second. Okay. Interesting. Bats didn't notice me. Okay with that. And, eh, can finish him off with arrows. Not a big deal. Okay, what's my opinion on doing an idle clicker game with an auto clicker? Um, honestly, if I was to do, like, a clicker game, actually, I should probably just pit the, piss these bot, uh, bats off. I think if I was to do a clicker game, what I would do is almost a race with another YouTuber. as like, kind of casual podcast play. 
That's what I would probably do if I was ever to do like a clicker game. Oh, this is a mimic. Well, let's just beat him to death before he can even retaliate. Um, mainly because I mean the clicker clicker games gameplay themselves not particularly interesting, uh, especially if you're using an auto clicker script, which kind of skips the core basis of the gameplay. Um. That said, if I had like either one YouTuber or multiple YouTubers just getting um, cycled on and stuff like that, I would totally um, I would totally like just sit there, chat, talk about various topics, and you know, kind of race the other person in terms of clicking. Okay, so I don't see a sacrifice shrine, so we're just bringing her with me. That's fine. I'm a little bit injured anyway, but no. Chances are that's what we're that's what I would do if I ever do a clicker game. But even then, that might it might also be like a uh, a Catterday thing where we all just throw it on and just have fun. Okay, because so we want shadow clones for the last one. Okay, and we'll be fine. So we've got. Okay, that was very lucky of me. All right, let's just piss everybody off. No way I can stealth past that, but I can totally just murder them. There we go. Watch me just immediately piss the worm boss off. That would be horrifying. Okay. Yep. Oh, the shadow clones are nice. Unfortunately, the knockback is not 100% functional. I don't know why that wasn't doing anything. Evil transformation. There we go. And we've got plenty of mana, so I can get my health back, too. Yeah. Hey, Osin. Yeah, uh, just watch Game Dev Tycoon. Well, you're in luck. We might be playing it next. I don't know. It really depends on how long this run goes and if I'm satisfied. If I'm not satisfied, I might end up going play like Tower of Guns or something. Because I would like to play that too, or Binding of Isaac. I don't know. That's an interesting question. Okay. So let's let's just stealth up and let's go around the fuck. I'm just going to stay very careful here. Even though I do have uh, vampirism in retrospect. So I could actually get my health back. No problem. Would still prefer to be as undamaged as possible. Now we've got a... Now we've got a... Uh, Dragon Slayer, which is all but useless on us. Um, I did buy a scroll of identification, correct? Did I not? Oh, I have one. Well, that was... riskier than I wanted it to be. Okay. So we've got a couple of flame bugs running around. I don't have feather fall. I don't have spike protection. This, of course, usually signifies extreme danger that I do not want to be a part of. Ah, oh, we don't want to, want to go there. We want to kill the worms, though. Let's just murder this one. Right and proper. Haven't pissed it off yet. I could stealth. Yeah, nope. Oh, okay. Okay, so we get another golden scroll, which is not regeneration, oddly enough. Taking small amounts of damage here. But small amounts, not synonymous with large. Okay, well, I mean, that go figure. That's like about as dumb as you can be. Common turf, fuck, whoa, hello. Oh, this is gonna end poorly for everyone. Me especially. Oh, fuck. Wow. Alright, so we have since murdered everything. We get Cestus. Ooh, don't think that increases my punching damage. But it's a very fast punching weapon if I want to go with... Uh, go that direction. Okay, now to not be here anymore, because this place is a hellhole that I do not want to be a part of. Let's... Oh, yeah, keep that positioning. Oh, baby. That's exactly where I want you to be. Is not that directly on top of... No, this is directly on top of Man Trap. There we go. Okay. And we have just enough healing that I think I'll be fine. Okay. Still got a couple of things to do. Don't think I heal from uh, boxes anymore, which is kind of unfortunate. Not going to mess with the mace. Have no need for it. Okay. We got two Dragon Slayers in one run. I, are you kidding me? It's not. I'm insulted, but oh well, not the end of the world. 
Let's see. So let's do shadow. We've got dagger. Let's go strength. We need the physical damage. Uh, so we've got magic missile. We've got a Cestus. Let's throw it on. Shocking and luck. I'm going to hope that it, it works with my gloves. Because that would be kind of a, a nice combo to run with. And let's throw evil transformation back on. We're 3 HP down. But still. Uh, oh, right. Go out this way. Okay, I think, yeah. I think we've got the, uh, the damage bonus from heavy punches. And the, the, um, and the claw. Okay, so let's, let's buy the potion of poison. Oh, see you, Tiger Fist. Have a good one. Let's buy the potion of poison. Let's poison the Cestus. Because I don't really, I don't really care about it. I just don't want to drink it. That's my main goal here. Yeah, look at that damage. Okay. And seeing as we do have mana shield in retrospect, so some of that mana is probably better suited for just keeping me alive than healing me here. Ah, eh, whatever. I'll do what I can. Okay. That's a lot of birds. Luckily, birds can't deal. Just stealth. Okay. And they can't deal with punches. Okay, we're looking good. We've healed quite a fair amount, and we've lost a qu quite a fair amount as well. At least, it doesn't seem like we have a whole lot of birds left. That's nice. Okay. Nope, nothing. That is a shame. Let's see. I'm not used to this game. How far am I? I am on level 2 out of 6? No, not level 2 out of 6. I'm level 4 out of 9. My bad. I was thinking of a different game. Uh, let's just get rid of the Dragon Slayers. As much as I love the idea of them, they're completely worthless on this character. And Blue Firebolt, okay. Let's switch back to Vampirism. Let's Vampirism up. Because I have no idea who I'm up against. I might as well... I didn't get any health from this guy. Son of a dick. I did a lot of damage to him, too. Oh, well. At least he's dead. That's nice. Do we know who are we fighting? Nope. I'll just go back to sneaking. Who knows what plants are? Mainly spiders. Oh, well. So now we know who we're up against. Am I happy about it? No. How am I going to fight him? Don't know. Don't have a plan. Don't have an anything. Okay. So let's see. So he's angry. Already. I'm just going to let him rampage. He can kill everything for me. So yeah, let's let's not vampirism for a little while. So I'm just I'm just gonna let him murder everything that I can possibly get him to murder. Well, that was useful. Problem is killing him. He's gonna. Are you kidding me? Right, because he pulled it through the wall. He can chuck it at me. Okay, luckily we have projectile reflection. Otherwise, that was gonna hurt. Okay, so I don't have a good way of fighting him. I do have some amount of arrows. We don't have much for dexterity. We do have the boomerang. Ooh, kit. So that actually does a highly, a high amount of damage to him. It's just a matter of getting him with the boomerang. It's hard. Also, getting our boomerang back is equally difficult. Okay. I can do, I can do sneak punches if we want to do that. Let's hide. Okay. So let's... Nope, you're you're just gonna roll again. Let's just leave you alone. Come on. This boss is about as prickly as you can get. Ah! Thank you, Mana Shield. For making my life easier. Oh, because that would have been a lot of damage. <sighs> How do we fight this guy? He's got, what, 150 health? Give or take? Oh, shoot. At least I got my uh, boomerang back. Of course, it immediately switches. There we go. Oh, interesting. It's not counted as ammo. It's counted as a different ranged weapon. That makes sense. Well, that missed. Let's just 
run and consider our options. We've got 150 arrows, but we do have uh, we do have a shrine of the deranged there, so I don't want to worry about. I don't want to think about it too hard. Oh, don't want to be there. Not while he's doing that. Don't pop up here. I got life. I got living. I got the pursuit of bap. That hurt. Only a little though. Okay, so we still got we still got a boomerang. I really have to make sure I don't blow up that shrine just because it could murder me. Oop! Fucking my 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 shadow clone is murdering that shrine before anything. Do I have free health care? Ooh. Okay. So this guy is such a pain. What? Oh, right. I don't have any mana, so I can't do anything in retaliation. Magic mapping. Teleport. Okay. So I'm gonna get a little distracted here. Let's think about what else we got. We do get a short bow. Hmm, might be good. Please be good. Please be really, really powerful. It's shocking. Yeah, that's close enough. Bap. Okay. So we're still not in a very good way. Fighting this guy is such a pain in the butt. At least we get shocking. That means damage to him. Ah. Okay, so that that's that's one thing. At the very least, we've got that. We've also got some mana now. Probably end up gonna get eaten by completely by mana shield, but you know what? Could be worse, right? Come on, scoop forward. Okay. We're gonna spend like 10 whole minutes on this boss fight. It's kind of a mess. Hop back down. Hop back down. I got arrows for you. Okay. So we're, we're Doing fairly well. We haven't taken too much damage, and we're not generally in immediate danger 90% of the time here. I just want to try very hard to avoid getting squashed. It'd be kind of shame to return to this game and immediately just kill get killed by my least favorite boss ever. Come on, give me some lightning. Give me some sweet, sweet lightning. There. Okay, we we get we did get a good hit in on him. I do have magic, but. No, I can't really cast them. Don't really have much of use for it. Or, not not that. I don't have a whole lot of mana left. Okay, so he's right there. He's gonna totally chuck a rock straight in my face. Can you die yet? That's why having at least one mod is a good... Uh, not mod. Uh, wand is a good plan. Unfortunately, no luck. Oh, well. Yeah, there's not a level timer. There's a mana limit. There's an HP limit. But, yeah, luckily there's no level timer. Well, duh. This this boss would need to be wildly retooled. If... Nope, do not... Okay, good. He did not just... Uh, the deranged did not immediately eat my key. If this, if this game had a level ti timer, most people probably wouldn't even fight the bosses in this game. Especially the golem. Like, he's just not worth fighting. When does game dev start? I don't know, whenever I die. Let's see, so let's put on the amulet. Amulet is... Demonic protection versus mana shield. Eh, let's go with it. It's got some good stats, which is mainly the reason. Okay. Uh, what's this game about? I don't know. It's roguelike. You go, you die. Rinse, repeat. It's fun, though. It's very hard. Let's see. So we don't, we don't need our dagger anymore. Let's get rid of that. Uh, keep the mana shield-ish. I don't know what any of these helmets do because I can't put them on. Uh, let's at the very least get rid of the damage reflection. That's not useful. Okay. Yeah, magic arrows ignore the golem's defense and eat them up. Oh yeah, no, I would totally be using uh, magic arrows if I could. Unfortunately, no magic arrows. Not currently, uh, did not drop. Makes me sad. Huh. That's an interesting question. Instead of, instead of a random loot system... Would it be better to have a... 
but it'd be better to have a structured loot system, not unlike uh, Binding of Isaac or Risk of Rain, with very set power-ups and a matter of choice. I think it would, actually. That's an interesting question, because uh, this game features more of kind of like a standard D&D style, where here's a bunch of different weapons. Sometimes they have magical effects. Uh, maybe not D&D necessarily, but still. Uh, Bor Borderlandsian? Diabloian? I don't know. I, I can't really think of a good example of, like, that loot sys system. But when I say, like, a general loot system, I mean, like, uh... You know, in Binding of Isaac, there's Polyphemus, which is very, very direct, recognizable, very direct. And you can kind of choose what items you get. That it might almost make more sense to have something like a Binding of Isaac item system along the way for most games, just in terms of, like, in this game, there's no variety after a certain point. You're just, you're just here, just doing your thing. You're just beating people to death with your fists or your daggers, and, like, honestly, you don't even, you're not even, you don't benefit by switching weapon types, except for punching, if only because punching has the best, uh, extra magical attacks along the way. Um... But, like, ulti ultimately, there aren't a whole lot of, like, interesting effects you can get on weapons. It's all just burning, shocking, vampirism, stuff like that. And so the concept of- Fuck, 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 fuck! Okay. Oh, we are one lucky duck. That could have gone very poorly for me. I wasn't e I didn't even, um... Wow. Yeah, I, I didn't even, like, move. His mouth just absorbed me. Never seen that before. Oh, do you have portal? Death becomes easier to encounter. I'd love to do a death becomes easier to encounter run at some point on one of these characters, but I just I can't see. I can't. I can't see the desire. Okay, this is gonna suck. I do not have a good place to fight this guy. At least I'm fast. My best bet is charge him before he gets any of his wisps out. Fuck. Not fast enough. Uh, okay, this is probably where we die. Let's just drink everything. Okay. I guess one alternative is... Okay, that didn't work as well as I wanted it to. Okay, we do have Feather Fall on... Oh, shoot, we did not... We do not have Regeneration? That's Strength. Oh, he's gonna start shooting them specifically at me. Fuck. Okay. Oh, we are in serious danger. Okay. Okay, let's just try and churn through as many of his wisps as possible. Got him. Alright, this is rough. This is rough. Indeed. Okay, let's just sack all of our money. At least we're not dead. And we've got, we've got some very, various bonuses and stuff like that. Okay. So let's just scoot on out of here. What do we have up here? The answer is great load of nothing. I'd like to know. It's probably the boss. Nah, boss chest wouldn't be up there. Boss chest would be over here. Should probably keep turning on vampirism. We're fairly good on health, but could be better. Right? Right. Don't think I want it unless it's uh homing. Oh shoot! You can't get by that. I was wondering. It's like it's it's a it's a wall. It's not a passable wall though. Duh. Now the unfortunate part is my uh my shadow clone does not have um fuck. My shadow clone does not have life steal. Oh, we are taking way more damage here than I wanted to take. Ah. Uh. And I, I was trying to be aggressive to just take them out, because fuck those guys. Unfortunately, not only does uh, vampirism have a very short duration, but uh, does not apply to uh, secondary characters attached to you. And does not even apply half the time. Kind of a shame. 
Oh well. Let's cast Vampirism before we get smacked. What was that? I don't know. Oh, a little bit of a little bits of damage here and there. Is that one dude or two? That was that was just one. Okay. Well, we leave the floor with eh, 50 HP, give or take a little bit. <laughs> don't know. Anyway. Uh, let's see. Shop didn't have anything useful. Let's just leave. <sighs> let's heal. Uh, do we have? We do not. So let's just let's just not for the time being. We get some damage, and we can leave. Okay, so we don't have the potions anymore, but we're we don't need them. I don't know. We don't have mana shield on. So that means damage is going to be at an all-time high, but I can keep with the regeneration. So assuming I don't get smacked around too much here. We'll be better off for it. Okay, that's a golem directly above me. You know, I was really hoping that that, you know, auto crit st stealth hit would actually... Oh, unless... It doesn't trigger vampirism? No, I actually have no idea how vampirism tr triggers in this game. It makes no sense. You cast it and you think, ah, yeah, it's gonna work. But no, it it only triggers occasionally and only heals you for like two health at a time. Yeah, it's not worth it. It's such a garbage spell. Which is a shame because I really want it to work, it just doesn't. Unless it's based on the amount of damage you do. But then again, I do almost 20, so there's that. Let's go around the other way. Man, I'm gonna sneeze soon. That sucks. Oh, shit, bird. Don't want to deal with that. Okay. A little bit too close for comfort. Fuck. Okay, there we go. We are dying. Alright, let's use... That's not a potion. We don't have any potions of regeneration. Or do we? We do! Okay, that's... That is encouraging. Why are the birds so freaking low today? There we go. Got him. Okay, so we do have regeneration. Our armor's not that great. We've got scrolls of uncurse aplenty. Okay. So let's get rid of the junk. Flame ore is good. Homing arrow. Ooh, we've got homing arrows now. Okay, so let's get rid of this business. So now we've got homing arrows. Unfortunately, coins heal injures. Okay, that's better than attackers will be shocked. So that's pretty much better than anything else. I don't actually know if that triggers based on our abilities, but still. It's really nice. Yeah, okay, so it, it does not trigger on our, on our shadow person, but still. Okay, so let's just... Let's just scoot. That was way less effective than I wanted it to be, and now we're beset by birds! Oh shit, he was still alive. Okay, and yeah, we've got the anti-bird gun. Anti-bird gun, go! Oh man, homing crossbows are the way to go. A little bit concerning at all times, but still. Ah, we found the boss. Alright, so we don't have poison resistance of any sort, do we? Nope, we don't. Oh fuck! Hmm. These are things that I do not want to be a part of. Screw you guys. All right, let's see if I can get around and flee to somewhere a little bit safer so I can figure out how to kill him. That, this is, this might not constitute as a little bit safer. How do you know where I am? You shouldn't. At least we got flame aura, so anybody deciding to be dumb and hang out directly beneath us is kind of in the clear. Fuck, he's directly on top of my face. Okay. We are so far so good. Anything else around here? No. Okay. And if you're just gonna come in and ask Game Dev Tycoon, you can at least say win. We'll be playing it next. Calm your tits. Holy shit, that was a lot of damage. Now let's run!
In retrospect, it might be a better idea if I timed it just as the heads come out, but that seems like a terrible idea. Okay. Oh, we're not we're not charging it, of course. And that did not work. Okay. So we'll have this guy down eventually. It's just a matter of very slowly. Don't walk towards me. Okay, at least I can make that fall. Okay. So I'm feeling fairly good about my options, just for a second. Don't know if I'm going to make it back up in time. Ye nope! When in doubt, go out punching! Okay, that was effective enough. Ah, uh, so we've got some health. Okay, got him. I knew he was pretty close to death. Actually, I didn't. I was purely guessing, but it worked out in the end. Okay, so let's switch back to Vampiric. Not like it's actually going to help me that much, but still. Now let's get some health. Okay, so we're pretty much going to die in the catacombs, but that's fine. Okay, so what do, what do we got around here? Not a whole heck of a lot. Come on. Die, you bastards. Die me, I guess. Hey, we get a bomb. And, oh, we've got homing arrows, of course. <laughs> Ooh-hoo. Is that it? Nah, he's not dead yet. Must have only done one damage to the plant. Well, then again, it's not a good idea. It's not a good idea to, um... There we go. I actually don't remember what I was going to say. Ring of Zygox is tempting. But I don't have the money anyway. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Uh, we've gotten the boss chest, right? No. I don't even know where it is. It's probably up here. Well, I'm glad I've got Shocking Claws. Like, you know, even when I'm not playing as uh, the Brawler Chick, I play as the Brawler Chick. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Actually, it makes plenty. She's my favorite playstyle by far, out of all of the characters. It's just she's slightly harder to use than uh, the Thief. Just because you can do um, stealth and stuff like that. Okay. And like Lance, it's not gonna really help me that much. None of these are good. Which is kind of the hard part to work with. Why are some of these level two and some aren't? I don't even know. Okay. Well this is going to be this is going to be concerning. Yeah, I guess we'll keep a like Lance. None of these are good though. Eh. Well. This is concerning. So do we have magic mapping? Okay, we have magic mapping. Oh! Fuck, 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 fuck. This is gonna hurt a lot. It did, in fact, hurt quite a lot. And now he's down there. Son of a bitch. Alright. So while we're at this, let's drink potions. I pretty much don't have a counter to hands or or zombies apart from just beating them to death. At least I've got punching. Which gives me some advantages. I got punching and I got strength. Oh, how did he not die? Unless there was another one or something. It looked like he went down, but he didn't. I don't know. Okay, that was concerning. Anyway. Still not completely safe. We got a dude up there. We've got a dragon. We do not have fire protection, unfortunately. Okay, at, at least I can hit and run. No matter what I can do, hitting and running is 100% viable. It's just a matter of surviving. Okay. So yeah, shock punch, pretty damn top. Oh, fuck. Yep. Okay, so we, we've got some good stuff going for us here. Is that... That is not a zombie coming out of the ground. Okay, I was wondering about that one just for a second. Okay. Wand of Chaos. Bleh. 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 Okay. Can I play... Can I play... Game Dev. 
Alright guys, the more you ask for game dev, the more I feel like just playing a different game to spite you. Not, not because I don't want to play game dev, but because, like, if I'm playing something else, don't ask me to play some- I, If I'm playing one thing, don't ask me to change games mid-game. I will switch when I'm ready, and trust me, I'm planning on switching. It's just very frustrating if I just see, play game dev, slightly later, play, play game dev, especially from the same people. That's not courteous. I'm here to entertain you, but I'm not, I'm not your dog. Okay, so we need to just, we need to just hide from this person. Nope, nope, that didn't work. You can't hit me from there. Okay, we are very vulnerable though. Okay, is there an update for Vigante? The answer is no. There is just, um, jeez, that is a lot of fire. Okay, we're leaving. Okay, we're leaving. Um. Oh, shit, zombies. How does he even know I'm there? It shouldn't be. Okay. Boop. Don't want to deal with your fireball. At least the uh, the tactics that work against the dragon effectively work against this bastard. Works out quite well. Come on. I got a punch for your face. Got him. All right. So you can kill him with uh, with just dirty tactics. I dig it. I dig it a lot. So what do we got over here? Shop? Looks like a shop. Okay. Ow. Do not have much health. Would prefer to leave with this as much as I can. Okay. Oh, he did not die. It looks like I did enough damage to him, but guess not. Okay, we get a push in regeneration at the very least. What else did we get here? Mana shield, attackers will be pushed back. Okay, nothing complete, nothing worthwhile, not even in the slightest. Okay. Let's see. New drop frames. Wow, that new internet really is doing quite well for me. Bonk. Did that only do six damage to him? It did. That's kind of an insult. Okay. He's dead already. We're doing surprisingly well. Along the way. Just leave me alone. We've got, we've got things to do. People to see. Punches to do. And fear, fear to live in. Because I think they nerfed these guys' damage just a little bit. Either that or it's the potion of defense working for me. Oh, that's not going to make the uh, next section easier, is it? Okay, and our inventory is, of course, full. That, whoa, okay, that's, well, that's, we're getting rid of mana shield at the very least. What's this? Flame, flame, flame pillar. All right. It's probably not going to be nearly much, nearly as much damage as I want. But still. I'm just gonna punch him to death. And elect Lance. V2. Okay, so I can flame pillar people. Actually, he's gonna do a... Look. Actually gonna do a fair amount of damage, too. Hey, look at that damage. I don't even have a high intelligence. What is this? I don't know. Hey, Shadow Panda. How's it going? Or I guess welcome back, really. Are right, you, you coming down here? I got I got a nice, nice little fire pit. Fuck. That hurt. At least we got death protection, but ultimately, I think there are other things I would rather have. Okay, he can hit me from there. I'm just gonna keep, just gonna keep running in fear, because I don't think we're getting to new game plus on this one. Spirit emitter plus two intelligence. All right. Yeah, that was worth it. Okay, let's stay away from the hand. Hand is scary. We've got a fire pillar, we've got the guitar, we've got a homing, uh, we've got a homing, uh, bow. Makes my life easier. He's gonna be able to smack me around, though, if I'm not careful. There we go. Hey, Emily. Welcome back. Okay, this is going fairly well. I'm glad we got the guitar. I, it's given me at least, like, four to five points of damage, which is actually kind of impressive. I was not expecting nearly that much. That much. But, we're making it. Oh, we're making it. Right, please, don't do anything stupid while you're here, Wander. Oh, I do have Featherfall. In retrospect, this is probably the last floor that we have it for, though. Unfortunately. Okay. Well, anyway. Wow, 64 viewers. Even for Vigante. Pressed. So, we've maxed out strength. That means damage. So, let's see. Uh, let's get rid of... That. We've got teleport, identify. What what do we have left? 
speed. Okay, and let's get rid of the boomerang. Let's get rid of the shocking bow. None of them, neither of them are going to be particularly helpful here, especially for the crypts. Okay, um, let's do not. Oh, we do actually have identify. Okay, what is this? Nah, it's not even that good. Not over death protection. Okay, so we get a freezing dagger. And nothing, actually. Okay. That's uncursed. Shit. I wanted magic mapping. Let's drink two of the speeds next. Seeing as we don't got... We don't have Featherfall anymore. We don't got... Hmm. Hmm? Okay. So this guy's gonna be a bit of a pickle to fight. Just because we've got the big ol' spikes to deal with. Then again... Maybe not. Maybe we're okay. We do 30, 32 damage when I hit things. Let's see. Yes, I have a Shadow Clone uh, ability. That's that's what the shadow is following me. It's really nice, which is it makes this character the best character in the game. Just in terms of, like, raw damage. Um, I like the... I like the... The question mark, question mark, question mark chick a little bit better. But still. Okay. Oh, right. We heal based on coin pickups. Okay, so let's actually hope we come across one of those thieves that steals all your money. Because, uh, oh, I could totally go for having my money stolen from me right now. That doesn't even make sense normally, but when you think about it in terms of every time I pick up a coin, I have a chance of... Fuck. Well, at least we didn't take full damage there. Okay. Speaking of... I'm gonna risk it. Okay. Oh, that was effective. Okay, so the, the flame pillar punch combo is very effective. Okay. This game, very stressful. Oh, hello. This is a party. Just turn the corner. Suddenly hands. Hands all up in the... F well, at least we get a potion regeneration from it. It's kind of a nice consolation prize. Okay. Come on, die before you turn around and make me miserable. Uh, do I care about that? Only if it has reach and then I can use daggers. Just because at this point, I don't know. The the punching is working really well for me, above all else. Actually, let's leave some fire for them. And while they're, while they're burning, I can punch them. Yeah! Alright, so we've got a really nice anti-zombie plan here. Okay, I'm worried about this hands. Let's go back for them in a second. Oh, welcome back, video games. Okay, punch... Punch everything. Punch everything equally. Holy shit, this is a new item. Ooh! Ooh, look at that! Alright, I've been looking I've been looking for the new items in this game. But um So this is the Ring of Celtioc, which gives you knowledge of where enemies are. So now I know exactly where every single enemy in the game is. Nice. Okay. So that was hairier than I wanted it to be. But yeah, now I now I can see where they are. Uh even if they're on the ground. Oh, man. That is such a nice thing. I... That is awesome. Oh, shit. Where'd he come from? The problem is it doesn't highlight them if you know where they are. Oh, no, 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 Fuck. Where's my potions regeneration? We're gonna need these. Okay. Death by barrel. We're getting there. Okay, so let's think. Prepare one of these. Line it up, too. Huh. That was instantaneous. We just blew up the shopkeeper. Okay. So that might have been a bit of, bit of a grave mistake. Apparently my Shadow Clone was not pointed the right direction. Probably would have gotten a hell of a lot more damage had I thought about that one. Okay. Come on. I got arrows straight for ya. Let's just keep running. I don't see any hidden enemies up this direction, so I don't have to worry about it too much. Alright. We are... 
in grave danger against him, but we're okay. Nice. Okay. Oh, hey, Arn and Locke. How Man, it's been a while since I've seen you. Welcome back. So let's just scoot our bits over here. We don't have much to worry about, and... God, I hope the shopkeeper's not pissed at me. Ah! Oh, it's not that he isn't pissed at me. He's just dead. Fuck. Alright, well... That's not exactly what I had in mind. But I guess we've murdered the shopkeeper. I guess eating him is entirely possible. How much longer for Vigante? You know what? I think now is a good time to save. This will actually be a two-part episode, crazily enough. Alright, so we've got... Oh, wait. One of those was different. Shocking and freezing. Ah, uh, nah. The guitar is better anyway. And unlimited jumps. We're actually going to hold on to. Okay, so let's go through. And let's heal. Get some decks. And save. Have you ever uh, tried the game from the depths? No. Never even heard of it. Anyway, so, uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next episode of, uh, Vigante. And as always, thanks for watching.